president also sent a high-powered sales force to Capitol Hill, where they were on the defensive over the president's controversial order to start pulling troops out by July 2011. I think that's the wrong impression to give our friends. It's the wrong impression to give our enemies. It's the wrong impression to give the men and women who want to go over there and win. Despite misgivings, most Republicans say they support the president's new war plan, but many liberal Democrats are already on the war path. Peace and security will not be found through a wider war. Some hope to block funding for the troop increase, expected to cost more than $30 billion a year. At a time when we are struggling to put Americans back to work, we just can't afford to escalate a war that we need to be winding down. Anti-war Democrats insist that once the troops are in, with or without a timeline, some will be there longer than anyone in the administration has admitted. Most military people think that this, uh, this operation goes on 10 to 20 years. I, while we would like to say we'll withdraw all troops from Afghanistan, we'll keep troops in that theater for many years to come.